Imagine a world where every action was isolated, with no connection to what comes next. It's a perplexing notion, isn't it? Thankfully, we don't live in such a world. Instead, we inhabit a realm where actions reverberate far beyond the immediate moment, where a seemingly small event can trigger a series of outcomes that stretch across time and space. Welcome to the realm of cause and effect, a concept that underpins the very fabric of our existence. At first glance, cause and effect might seem like a simple, if this, then that scenario, but beneath its surface lies a profound insight into the intricacies of life. From the grand narratives of history to the everyday choices we make, cause and effect weaves a narrative that connects each thread of existence. Understanding this concept isn't just an intellectual exercise. It's a key that unlocks a deeper comprehension of the world around us and empowers us to navigate its complexities. Definition of Cause and Effect Cause and effect is a fundamental concept that seeks to explain the relationships between events or actions and their subsequent outcomes. At its core, this principle asserts that for every action, there is a corresponding reaction or consequence. In essence, nothing happens in isolation. Every occurrence is linked to something that preceded it. Examples 1. Domino Effect Imagine a meticulously arranged row of dominoes. If you flick the first domino with just the right amount of force, it sets off a chain reaction. Each domino falls into the next, creating a visually captivating display. In this scenario, the initial flick is the cause that triggers the effect of the dominoes falling one after the other. This analogy vividly demonstrates how a single event can set off a series of interconnected reactions. 2. Rainy Day and Puddles Consider a rainy day where droplets fall from the sky. The cause here is the rain itself, and the effect is the formation of puddles on the ground. The raindrops accumulate and collect in depressions on the pavement, creating small bodies of water. This cause and effect relationship underscores how natural phenomena can give rise to observable outcomes. 3. Studying in Grades Let's delve into the world of academics. If a student consistently dedicates time to studying a subject, the cause is their effort and commitment. As a result, the effect might manifest as improved grades on assignments and exams. The cause, which is the diligent studying, directly contributes to the effect of achieving higher academic performance. By grasping the concept of cause and effect, we gain a deeper comprehension of the intricate web that connects actions and their consequences. This understanding empowers us to make informed choices, predict outcomes, and navigate the complex tapestry of existence with greater insight. Historical Perspective The understanding of cause and effect has undergone a fascinating evolution over the course of human history. From ancient philosophical musings to modern scientific inquiries, the exploration of this concept has shaped how we perceive events, make predictions, and comprehend the world around us. Ancient Philosophers In antiquity, philosophers like Aristotle pondered the nature of causality. Aristotle introduced the idea of four types of causes. The material cause, what something is made of. The formal cause, the blueprint or design. The efficient cause, the agent causing an event. And the final cause, the purpose or goal. This holistic approach laid the groundwork for future discussions on causation medieval and renaissance thinkers. During the Middle Ages and the Renaissance, philosophers like Thomas Aquinas merged Aristotelian concepts with religious perspectives. They explored how divine will and natural processes intertwined to produce outcomes, bridging theology and philosophy. Scientific Revolution The scientific revolution brought a seismic shift in how cause and effect were understood. Thinkers like Isaac Newton formulated laws of motion and universal gravitation, providing a framework for predicting the behavior of objects in the physical world. This marked a transition from philosophical contemplation to empirical observation and mathematical modeling. Modern Philosophers In the realm of philosophy, Immanuel Kant delved into the nature of causation, questioning whether it was a fundamental aspect of reality or a mental construct. 
His insights spark debates that continue to shape philosophical discussions on causality. Contemporary Science In modern times, advancements in fields like physics, biology, and psychology have deepened our grasp of cause and effect. Quantum mechanics challenged deterministic notions, introducing probabilistic causality. Complex systems theory revealed how seemingly unrelated factors could combine to produce emergent phenomena, highlighting the intricacies of interconnected events. By exploring the historical progression of cause and effect, we appreciate the diverse perspectives that have shaped our understanding. From ancient philosophies to cutting-edge scientific theories, this exploration enriches our awareness of how this fundamental concept has evolved over the ages. Scientific Explanation The scientific foundation of cause and effect lies in fundamental principles that govern the behavior of the physical universe. Two key concepts that underpin this understanding are Newton's laws of motion and the law of conservation of energy. Newton's laws of motion Sir Isaac Newton's laws of motion are cornerstones of classical physics. They describe how objects interact with forces and how these interactions result in motion. Newton's first law, often called the law of inertia, states that an object at rest remains at rest, and an object in motion continues to move with a constant velocity, unless acted upon by an external force. This concept illustrates how objects tend to maintain their state unless influenced by a cause, such as a force. Newton's second law relates force, mass, and acceleration. The force applied to an object is directly proportional to its mass and the acceleration it experiences. This law quantifies the cause and effect relationship between force and the resulting change in an object's motion. Newton's third law asserts that for every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. When one object exerts a force on another, the second object responds with an equal and opposite force. This law demonstrates the interconnectedness of interactions in the physical world, highlighting how actions and reactions are inherently linked. Law of Conservation of Energy The law of conservation of energy is another crucial scientific principle. It states that energy cannot be created or destroyed. It can only be transferred or transformed from one form to another. This principle emphasizes that the total energy within a closed system remains constant. In cause and effect terms, any change in energy within a system is a direct result of energy being transferred or transformed due to various causes, such as mechanical work, heat exchange, or potential energy conversion. In essence, the scientific explanation of cause and effect is deeply rooted in these principles demonstrating how forces and energy transfers influence the motion and behavior of objects, as well as the broader systems they are part of. This scientific understanding allows us to predict and explain the outcomes of various interactions in the physical world. Complex Interactions Cause and effect relationships are not always straightforward. They can often be intricate and interconnected, resulting in a web of influences that shape outcomes. These complex interactions highlight the intricate nature of the world and the unpredictability that can arise from seemingly unrelated events intertwining. Interconnected Causes In many cases, an effect can have multiple causes, and a cause can trigger a chain of interconnected effects. This web of interdependence is especially evident in systems involving many variables, such as ecosystems or social dynamics. Each cause becomes not just a singular factor, but a node in a network of causes that contribute to a larger outcome. Butterfly Effect and Unintended Consequences The butterfly effect is a term often used to describe how a small change in one part of a system can lead to significant effects elsewhere. The concept highlights the sensitivity of interconnected systems. Similarly, complex cause and effect relationships can lead to unintended consequences, outcomes that are not anticipated or intended when a particular cause is initiated. For example, introducing a new species into an ecosystem to control a pest might inadvertently disrupt the balance of the entire ecosystem, causing unintended harm to other species. Similarly, economic policies designed to stimulate growth might lead to unforeseen economic imbalances. Emergent Phenomena 
Complex interactions can also give rise to emergent phenomena, where collective behaviors emerge from individual interactions. These phenomena cannot be easily predicted by analyzing individual causes and effects alone. Examples include flocking behavior in birds or traffic patterns in a city. Understanding and navigating complex interactions and unintended consequences is a reminder of the need for careful consideration in decision-making, as well as the humility in acknowledging that the interconnectedness of the world can lead to outcomes that may not have been initially foreseen. Determinism versus Free Will The debate between determinism and free will is a long-standing philosophical question that delves into the nature of human agency and the causality of events. Determinism Determinism asserts that all events, including human actions and decisions, are the inevitable outcomes of previous causes. In other words, every event has a predetermined cause that dictates its occurrence. Under determinism, the universe operates like a complex chain reaction, with each event leading inexorably to the next. Free will. On the other hand, the concept of free will suggests that individuals possess the ability to make conscious choices that are not entirely dictated by previous causes. It implies a degree of autonomy, allowing individuals to deliberate, decide, and act based on their own intentions, desires, and beliefs. Examples from various fields. Economics. In the realm of economics, the law of supply and demand exemplifies cause and effect. When demand for a product rises, cause, its price tends to increase, effect. Conversely, when supply exceeds demand, prices may drop. Psychology. In psychology, the concept of operant conditioning highlights cause and effect relationships. Positive reinforcement, cause, encourages behavior repetition, effect, while punishment, cause, discourages its recurrence. Ecology. In ecology, the predator-prey relationship is a classic cause and effect scenario. An increase in prey populations, cause, can lead to a subsequent rise in predator populations, effect, as predators have more food resources available. By exploring these examples across various fields, we gain a broader perspective on how cause and effect relationships shape diverse aspects of our lives and the natural world. These examples also offer insights into the intricate mechanisms at play and the fascinating interplay between different factors. Chaos theory is a branch of mathematics and science that deals with the behavior of complex and nonlinear systems. It emphasizes how small changes in initial conditions can lead to vastly different outcomes over time. This phenomenon is often referred to as the butterfly effect, where the flap of a butterfly's wings could set off a chain of events, leading to a hurricane on the other side of the world. Chaos theory challenges the idea that predictability and control are always possible in complex systems. It shows that even with precise knowledge of an initial state, the long-term behavior of a system can become unpredictable due to its sensitivity to initial conditions. This theory has applications in various fields, from meteorology to economics, highlighting the inherent complexity of cause and effect interactions. Ethical Considerations Understanding cause and effect relationships carries ethical implications, especially when human behavior and decision-making are involved. Responsibility On one hand, Recognizing cause and effect can lead to a sense of responsibility. If individuals understand that their actions can have far-reaching consequences, they may feel compelled to make ethical choices to avoid negative outcomes. Blame and accountability. However, understanding cause and effect also raises questions about blame and accountability. If someone's actions lead to unintended harm, determining the extent to which they are responsible can be complex. Context, intent, and external factors can all play a role in shaping outcomes. Social dynamics. In a broader societal context, understanding cause and effect can prompt us to consider systemic factors that contribute to certain behaviors. This can lead to discussions about addressing root causes rather than just focusing on individual culpability. In essence, the ethical considerations surrounding cause and effect remind us of the complex interplay between personal agency, external factors, 
and the broader consequences of our actions. It prompts us to carefully evaluate the impact of our decisions and encourages thoughtful, compassionate, and responsible behavior. In wrapping up our exploration of the reality of cause and effect, we've delved into a world where every action sets forth a chain of events, weaving a complex tapestry that shapes our lives and the world around us. From the interconnectedness of events to the intricate dance of systems, we've seen that cause and effect is a fundamental principle that touches every facet of our existence. We've journeyed through the annals of history, tracing the evolution of our understanding, from the musings of ancient philosophers to the groundbreaking insights of scientific revolutionaries.